So that brings in the power hitting middle Lead infielder off. Paul DeYoung. He'll lead things off Not here in this stop. one run contest. DeYoung. In there for strike one. DeYoung in an 0 2 hole here. The wind up and the 0 2 pitch. And he fouls this one off. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. This is flared out towards second. And this will be put away easily for the out. Stepping into the box, Benito Santiago. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Santiago. Now a swing and a miss at a slider for a strike. One out, nobody on. Count remains at 0-2. Hey, I don't mind you throwing a fastball in this situation, but I think, if we're being honest with ourselves, that one caught a little bit too much of the plate. He takes strike three called on the fastball. Couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. First no delivery picture. to him on the way. Yeah. The slider is laid off on the inside as it just misses the zone. Well, that's a great take there right there on that slider down and in. That's one of the toughest pitches to lay off of as a hitter. That hard breaking ball coming down and in at the back foot. A tough take on a good pitch. And he'll come back with one in the dirt as the count moves to two and one now. Well, these are just extra pitches that are just going to add to your pitch count. He's not trying to work around him and no reason to. But sometimes you just lose the strike zone for no apparent reason. Keith Hernandez would be next. Now here's the check swing, and they appeal down to first. No swing. So that's ball four. So a runner at first with two away. The and that'll bring up the former National Keith. League MVP, Eight. Keith Hernandez. Hernandez. In there, and it's 0-1. Here comes the nothing in two pitch. Three. Throws him for strike three, and that retires. Digging in for his second at bat, Ichiro Suzuki, a base hit in his first trip. The center field. Here comes the first pitch. Ichiro Suzuki. Line toward center field. Griffey Jr. is there, and he has it for the first out. Riding in once again, Ian Kinsler looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this A.B. Takes this the other way to right. But this will hang just long enough for him to run it down in shallow right for the second out. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Bryce Harper fly down in his first half bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. Almost, Matty. Almost went deep his last A.B. Certainly just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard this A.B. A one and one count. Here's the pitch. Sliced hard on the ground. Played on the backhand. And they will not get him at first as he's able to leg out the throw. Stepping in, George Brett comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Up and in there with the first pitch fastball, it's ball one. Now a move over to first, and he'll dive back in safely. Harper, the runner at first with two gone. And another throw over and a dive, but he's back in. And look out as that fastball ran in and got him. Striding in, Billy Williams. Two men on, two away here in the fourth. 
Williams. Here's the first pitch to him. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground. But this is foul for the first strike. Here's the 0 2. Now a fastball as he just reared up and let that one fly, and the inning is over. Into the box, Chipper Jones. He set to lead us off in the home half of the fourth inning. And a ball 1 0. Jones. Good zip on that one as he just throws it by him for strike one. Hey, if these guys are going to have any chance in this one, they are going to have to set their sights a little lower. You cannot expect to get the barrel of the bat to that baseball. That is entirely too high. Wanted to go after the slider, but he holds off three and one. They know the threat this guy possesses at the plate. I know it's three one in this situation. Took something off there, but this is hit well anyway out to deep center. He gets under it and makes the catch in the deep part of the field. Now with the, the plate, right fielder, Bryce Harper. 34. He got on top of one. It was a ground out victim last time. Harper. Line to second where it's caught there for out number two. The batter. So number here's the cleanup 16. hitter, Garrett Anderson. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Line toward right center. And that's a base hit. One for two in his first couple of plate appearances. So Brandon Phillips will bat next with two away. The batter, so the runner at first zero. here with two gone in the second inning baseman. and stepping in the Red second Jack. baseman Brandon Phillips. Phillips one ball no strikes to count he's ready here's the 1 0 oh now here's a drive out to the alley and this one will bounce into the wall Anderson rounds third and is digging for the plate he comes across to score we're all square at one apiece. Digging in now, Ken Griffey Jr. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. This is hit the other way out toward left field. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Settling in now, Joe Torrey. He'll start off the fifth in this one. The catcher, Joe Torrey. First pitch coming, here it is. Oh, he just blows the fastball by him for strike one. Well, now that we're midway through this one, it's safe to say that runs have been at a premium, and both starters doing it in different ways have turned in excellent performances. Dan, you could speak to this. Obviously, two different ways to skin a cat. One's a finesse guy working all four quadrants, keeping guys off balance. The other, a flamethrower coming right at you. Yeah, it's been a story of like two different styles of pitches, but both getting the same thing, both throwing strikes early, keeping the ball down in the zone. As you touched on it, there's more than one way to get around through a lineup, and we've seen one guy with power and one guy do it with more skill and finesse. And quickly, there are two away. Now to the plate, the now pitcher, bad. Chris the Sale. Pitch. 0 for 1 Chris. for him here in this one. Yeah. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. Mm, clearly fooled there on the slider. This guy's been on cruise control as we head into the middle innings of this one. And one of the big factors why, how about 80% of his first pitches have been for strikes. Into the windup, here comes the 0-2 pitch. Swing and a miss got him reaching. Santiago recovers. The throw to first is in time, and the inning is over. At the plate, Paul DeYoung. Leading off. Now here it comes. Not shortstop. A high fastball is in there. DeYoung. Takes this the other way to right. And a base hit, so the leadoff man is aboard. Stepping into the box, Benito Santiago. He got called out on strikes his last time through. And a fastball in the dirt that's taken for a ball. And he fires in a strike this time to make it one ball and one strike. The 1-1. One -one. And he gets him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. Number five. He's under it. No problem. One away. So here now is the pitcher, Jack Morris. He could be bunting here in order to stay out of the double play. 
Swing and a miss, 0 and 1. Off the plate and in, hits a ball and a strike. And they'll try and play for one here as he gets this one down. Only plays to first, so the pitcher does his job as it's a successful sacrifice. And that brings up the former MVP, Keith Hernandez. Runner in scoring position with Sujan. Ball one to start the at bat. And he finds a way to catch the zone here. It's one and two. That's three straight sliders in a row. I'd be shocked. I would be shocked if he went to that well a fourth time. I'd be looking here. Count even at two and two. Fastball didn't miss by much, and it's a full count now. Three and two. Now on three and two as a pitcher, you've got to go with the pitch that you feel most comfortable throwing with. And that misses ball four, so it's first and second now with two out. Go! First pitch of the at bat. Oh, and a hearty cut there to begin the at bat. It's nothing in one. Well, this has been a lot of pitches for him out of the bullpen. As you can see there, they're asking a lot of him in this one. So I wouldn't be surprised if he gets a day off or two after this one. Still no balls and two strikes. That wasn't a terrible pitch right there. But if he's going to execute and get this swing and a miss, he's going to have to get that ball a little bit further down. Maybe even potentially bounce the next one. And the two-out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over.